now I'm going to go over the certain battery saving modes you have on a Pixel device. Um, so you can go ahead and turn on battery saver to help you save battery life if you're running a little low and you're not going to be able to get access to a charger um, for a little while. You can turn on this mode to help conserve battery. And we're also going to go over the other options and how you can modify battery saver mode to fit your needs. So the first thing we want to do is jump into our phone settings by swiping down twice from the top. And then you can see your settings icon in the bottom right. Then you want to go to battery. You can already see it already says our percent and about how long it should last. So let's tap on that. And we have a few different things here. You, you can see your battery percentage, how long it, the phone thinks it's a, it'll last till at your current usage, and a bunch of other information. But if you want to extend um, your battery life, you want to go to Battery Saver. Now, once we're here, we have a few options here. Extreme Battery Saver, which we'll go over in a little bit. Set a schedule or turn off when charging and the turn on now button. So if we click on that, that'll turn on battery saver and that's actually gonna go ahead and put our phone in um, the dark theme to help save battery and restrict a few other things um, like apps that are working too long in the background and stuff like that. It's gonna go ahead and shut some of that down and remove some other features as well to help save us battery life. You can see that down here and you can click the learn more and it'll show you more things that it does to help extend your battery life. So I'm gonna turn that back off for now. So the that's just normal battery saver, turning that on or off. You can set this to a schedule. You can say no schedule. You can do based on your routine. So battery saver turns on if your battery is likely to run out before your next typical charge. So it learns your charging behavior and it'll go, okay, I think the phone's gonna run out of battery before you're able to charge when you typically do. So I'm gonna turn on battery saver. It's kind of a smart feature, right? Or you can do it like I have, which is based on a percentage. So when my phone hits 15% battery life left, battery saver is going to kick on and start being used. But you can adjust that um, to what you would like. Okay, I'm going to put it back at 15, but you can set that to what you want along that slider. And then this next option is it's going to turn off battery saver mode uh, when your phone is at 90% or higher. I just leave that on in case I forget to turn battery saver mode off. It'll do it for me once the phone hits 90%, but that's up to you. Another thing to keep in mind is battery saver mode does not work uh, when your phone is plugged in and charging. So it will turn battery saver mode off when your phone is plugged in and charging. Now the last thing we're going to go over is extreme battery saver mode. Now this will take things to the next level. So you know it's going to be a really long time um, before you get to your next charge and you really need your phone to last long and battery saver, um, the general battery saver mode is not enough. You can do extreme battery saver. So if we select that, you get two options here. Uh, you get when to use. So we'll tap on that first and you can have it ask every time battery saver mode is turned on. So whether normal battery saver uh, turns on automatically by itself or you turn it on, you're actually gonna get a notification up here that asks if you want to turn on extreme battery saver mode. So that's what I have selected. You can say always use um, extreme battery saver. So you can select that too. So whenever normal battery saver mode kicks on, extreme battery save mode will also kick on or you can say never use again i'm going to just leave it at ask every time because i won't always 
need extreme battery saver. Normal battery saver will typically work well enough for me, but sometimes there's those days where you're just not going to be able to charge your phone and you need it to last even longer. This is a good option. So the other option in extreme battery saver is the essential apps. So if we tap on that, it'll load up a list of applications, all the applications we have on our phone. And basically we can select apps um, so they won't be paused when extreme battery mode um, is turned on. So basically, if there's an app or something you know you're going to want to use in extreme battery saver mode, you can go ahead and give it a check mark. That way it still works when extreme battery mode saver is turned on. Um, so you may be thinking like messages and phone calls and stuff like that. Um, but those are actually system apps. So they um, won't turn off. So I can actually show you, you can see messages here. Um, this is the built-in default messenger for Pixel phones. Um, you can see I can't uncheck it. It's grayed out. That's because it will be on. But if you use another messages app, like WhatsApp or something, you might want to go ahead and give it a check mark. If getting text messages um, still through to your phone when you're on extreme battery saver mode matters uh, to you. So basically what's going to happen is when we turn on battery saver mode, any app here that is unchecked, um, will be inaccessible. I mean, I'll show you in a second. It'll be grayed out on your home screen, um, so you can't use it um, right away. You can tap on it, and it'll pop up a message saying, you know, this has been turned off, um, and then you can turn that app on and use it if you want to. But I'll show you that kind of what that looks like right now. So here are all the apps I have selected to still work when Extreme Battery Mode Saver is turned on. So we'll go over that in a second. I'm just jumping out here. Um, to turn on battery mode, you can do it in the settings like I showed you before, or maybe you have it in your quick settings up here at the top, which I do. If I swipe over, I can see battery saver right there. So I'm actually gonna turn it on from there. And you can see my phone's gone into dark mode. It's doing just the normal battery saving um, stuff here, not extreme battery saver yet because I have it set to ask me every time, right? So you can actually see here is it asking me to turn on extreme battery saver. And this is going to limit a bunch of stuff. It's going to limit all the apps that I didn't check in that section. So if I tap on that, it is now turned on extreme battery saver. As you can see, some of my apps are grayed out here and I can't use them, right? So like if I try to tap Chrome, it'll say app paused by extreme battery saver. Keeping Chrome paused extends the battery life of your phone. You can unpause it temporarily or set essential apps um, to always work in settings. So you can unpause it temporarily if you want to. Um, or you can just tap OK, and that'll bring you back here. So if you did turn on Extreme Battery Saver, but you really do need to use one app that is grayed out, you can easily kind of do that if you want to. Um, but just do keep in mind, it's going to restrict every app. You're not going to get notifications from any of these grayed out apps that you didn't select in that menu or anything like that. Um, just to go ahead um, so it can prolong your battery life. But that's how you go ahead and adjust some of the battery saving uh, settings and the different modes that, um, on a Pixel device. Hopefully this video helps, and if it does, go ahead and leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this one on how to make technology work better for you. Thanks.